I recently bought two iPod Classics off of eBay, and I was hoping to combine them both and make one proper one that actually works. Uh, I did succeed in doing this, however I did run into some issues getting this back casing back on. I couldn't find anywhere online any video or any explanation guide on how to get this back cover back on. All the videos, um, they just pretty much ended when you got there. They didn't show you how to push it on there. So my issue was that uh, on the bottom and the sides too, but the bottom is uh, the issue with this particular iPod, those little hooks, they're supposed to be bent downwards, uh, such as this one right here above my fingernail. Unfortunately, when I took it off, I don't think I did it properly, and these tabs bent upwards. Now this is not quite as bad as the other iPod that I fixed, but the way I found to fix it is I just took a little metal tool, you can probably use a knife, squeezed it, and made sure that it was flattened out, not completely flat against the uh, the metal, but just bent downwards so that it's not sticking out, um, such as this one is. I apologize for the camera not focusing. This camera does not like to focus on anything. But yes, all of your tabs should be as flush as you can, um, but just pr out, out a little bit, because what it has to do is grip onto these um, little plastic slots so that the front of the iPod doesn't come off. So basically, flatten them out, and uh, you should be able to take it and press it on. Well, I'm not doing it correctly, but yes, after that, you should be able to just press it on. And now it's making me look like a liar. Yeah, I'm doing it one-handed, it's not even lined up properly, but you get the point. Um, press those tabs down, make sure they stay down, and you should have one working iPod. Hope I helped some of you, and uh, thanks for watching.